Kubo TV guys! Ancient Wilds, that's what we're running! Not keeping that hand. <laughs> oh, I can't keep that hand! Okay, that's okay. Slightly better. <laughs> oh well, this could be a quick and nasty game. Couldn't keep the first hand. Too many big cards in the second hand. One big creature. At least in this hand they've got oh, dream puppets or crosswinds. Possibly prefer dream puppets. Uh, draw a card. I think it is dream puppets. Um, I hope. <laughs> Could possibly be the better option. Uh, do, 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 do. Get him out first I suppose. Because of the reach and the death touch we'll get him out first. So our deck, we've got our Thornweld Archer, 2-1 with reach and death touch. We've got our Shaman, which can sack any creature in my, in my hand for another creature. Beast Within and Overrun. Uh, what the hell's that? Never seen this card before. Oh no, I have. Uh, yeah, so the, it is the mill deck, so he's basically going to start tapping me down with that thing later on. Not too fast just now. This has actually not worked out too badly with having to draw the two cards because I'm playing the mill deck. He's got less power on the battlefield. And drop that down. Swing in for two. I could beast within that if I want. Get rid of it, but I'm not worrying about it right now. We will drop her down as well just to get more power on the battlefield. No point in keeping her in our hand. We've at least drawn something worthwhile, but it's all about the next hand. I mean, a land would be good, I could get him out, but then where do we go from there? You know, we're not looking so strong. He's left three cards open. We do hit our land. So we're going to swing in, see what he's got, because he might have something to ping my boys back. He doesn't look like he has anything, so we're taking him down four. Well, we're quite happy with that. I think he's pro possibly got a counter in his hand, so we'll do cast that anyway. Has he got? He might have. Might have a cancel, he might leave it, because it's like it's one of those mid-level creatures where you're thinking, nope, he's going to counter it. That's fine. I just thought it might be one of the mid-level creatures, it might not fast, but he's going to stop that coming out. Could have held off there, guys, but I need to get power on the battlefield, I suppose. We're not in the strongest positions with these two cards in hand. Ooh. Hopefully he'll play something that'll allow me to draw some cards, that would be nice. Let me draw some cards. He didn't hit his land by the looks of things, so I could beast within one of his tokens after I've attacked. But that's probably not the best move because it puts a 3-3 on his side and as I said, look at my bottoms of my two boys, they're not very strong. But he hit his land anyway, so that the whole debate was pointless. He's going to copy one of my boys, probably the guy with death touch. Yep. Bah. But at least that's not the best way of the use of cloning. Eh, phew, phew. Oh dear, oh dear. Right, skip the turn. Nothing we can do. Oh dear, oh dear. Dear, oh dear, oh dear. Not the best position. That wild painting was not the best card to draw there. That's up to four now. Oh, go on. That's handy. Um, there, this is basically allows. At the beginning of each player's draw step, that player draws two additional cards. Very handy for me, because we're like, you, you know. I need the cards. Excellento. Drop that. Uh, ooh. I think the play is to drop that. Get rid of this, because it's at four now. Get rid of that. He's not used that, so that's been a complete waste for him. End our turn. Keeping this in the hand basically for the Wild Pairing because then I can cast that with Wild Pairing and get Gigantomancer out and then we'll be in a really strong position. He's got his wee crab dude. That card can be annoying but we do have our Beast Within if it gets too worrying. So yeah, drop the land, tap me down. Hopefully get some up. I was hoping it would put some of my Vange Fens in there but Eternal Witness is in the graveyard which is sad. Eh... Uh, Do, 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 do. He's going to clone something again, probably this dude, ping one of my lands. So that's not worked out at all. I might clone his crab. Nope, he's going to ping that and ping one of my lands. So I'm down to land again. It's a little bit sad, it means while Perrin doesn't come out, now he's going to mill me a little bit more. 
The least thing is he's wasted his two clones on what I'd call two lesser creatures. So, it's now our play, we draw some extra cards, we do get lands, which is nice. So, we drop the land. This is the play, I think. We... I want to keep my spider, because this deck does have flyers. Right, this is the play. Swing them our two death touch boys, because they'll just cancel each other out. Um, he'll probably block. If not, he goes down to 10. Yep, yeah, that's what I thought. Yep, yeah, they cancel each other out. Happy days. Drop her. Draw a card. Excellent. Drop our wood else. Now we've got our mana up there, which is nice. Drop our mana. Uh, we're going to be dropping this next turn. So, do we want to ping something and put it in the graveyard? I've got eternal witnesses in the graveyard, so I can't get any more cards out of my graveyard anymore. So I don't think so. I think we just don't bother with her ability at the moment. There's nothing in my hand, creature-wise, that I want to get rid of yet. So it mills me a wee bit more. Is Vines, a Vines Vend went in yet? Nope, still no Vines are in there. We've lost our 7-7, seven, seven, lost our Wolves, Element. So, yeah, yeah, there's another dude to mill me a little bit more. At the beginning of your upkeep, you put the amount of cards you've got in your hand and your, uh, in, into you off the top of your pile. So I'm putting 5. Right. Oh, drop that. It looks like he's left mana open for a cancel. Gigantomancer's now in the graveyard, which is really bad. Not a single Vengeven. Every time I play Dream Puppets, man, none of my Vengevens ever go in the graveyard, like the last time. Okie dokie. So what's our play here? I think our play is to drop... Mm, he's left mana open for a cancel without a shadow of a doubt. So our play is to drop this guy. Go and draw a card. We draw a land, not the best. Uh, swing in, do we swing in with everybody? Nope, just swing in with her. Get in for maybe two, I don't know if he'll block. And then next turn before his end of his turn, I'm going to probably beast the token that to slow down the mana lot, the, the milling. We're at 25 cards now, so we really want to slow that down. Let it mill him for a turn. Because next turn we'll be losing a lot of cards and we can't be allowing that to happen. So he's going to drop another crab, he's going to drop more land. Two crabs to cost me more mana, this is probably going to be GG. I'm losing too many cards now. I've got no power on the battlefield. Nothing worthwhile anyway. Losing more cards. Oh, well that's... Look at that. No, that's disgusting. <laughs> Absolutely disgusting. My beast token's gone. It's game over now. Not a thing I can do. Mm, I've got two cards. I need to win this turn. Um, uh, I've got nothing in my deck that, that I can go and get because everything's dead. So we may as well just play it anyway. Who cares? Sack that. Let's get this game over and done with. Oh, cancel it. Oh, that's great. And it sacked my creature though. Nut. Nah. Who cares? It was game over anyway. There you go, guys. Well, that's me getting owned by the Dream Puppets. I'm just milling myself down. Let's just do this. Activate ability. Let's win him the game. Oh, I've got no creatures in my deck. So the, my last cards were all mana. Which doesn't help me out. So there we go guys, GG. Kuber TV. Signing out. Once the game's over, obviously. I'll let the game end. TY, what are you saying TY for, dude? Come on. Just finish this game over. There we go. End of the game. Skip your turns, come on, dude. It wouldn't have marred even if I'd beast token this thing anyway. The game was still over. Not the best of hands, but that's Ancient Worlds for you. Cooper TV, signing out.